that was one crazy episode. Episode 7 titled The Ghost Client with the um, fake detectives. Yes. So in this one, they go up against some fake detectives, which is Seiho and them. And it's hilarious as the, the beginning, but then it leads, it's like a case they're supposed to find like this girl. She was supposed to be engaged to her boyfriend, but all of a sudden it's like, you know, she said, I die, I need to find him. And so it's like possessing the lady who hired them. And she's all like, whoever wins this case gets this money. And she gives them all these clues and they go and get all these clues and it leads them to one location. And when they pull out the item, it was actually a bag of of the girlfriend she got killed and the boyfriend left her in the bag and dropped her and but just when they're about to you know turn him in he gets shot in the head yes and like it was a setup yeah. it was a setup it, the whole point of it was the the group that had been killing all the criminals it was a setup to get to draw out the criminal so that they can also eliminate him next but we got a big big reveal in the whole plot of the story it turns out that my prediction was right. <laughs> she was right, but I caught it in the beginning. My oh my god! Was right, you guys will see in our reaction. I was like, I, it just got onto me today that her <clears throat> earring in today's episode, her earring was so similar to the shoe. And when they walked into the cafe, I was like, oh my god, her shoes. She got the shoes. Yes, her shoes. But, but before we talk about that, I think we have to get. We have to. Um, really talk about the case. The case was all, again. They have been using a lot of very, very real and sad cases that have been going that that for their for their cases for the detectives to solve. This one, there was a lot of funny moments, but the whole point of the 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 investigation, it was really sad. The guy ended up killing his fiance or his girlfriend, who was going to who was believed to become his fiance he killed her and we don't know what she you know uh, has in store but whatever the case is the criminal killed her and then obviously he gets killed so and it's like it was Bo, Bo, uh, Bo Hyung who actually did it. He was the sniper. And previously, when I was editing for the previous episode, I caught on to his look. And it just, I just forgot, I forgot to tell you about yeah. it. And I'm like, oh shit, it was him. But I mean, but they, yeah, they, they're, they're, they're part of a different team. And they're, they've been trying to get these detectives and Lee Sigi is actually the one they're after which they thought they killed at the beginning but he survived and he passed on this information to Jay Soup. So now he's basically right. the last target they have to get. Yeah, I yeah. think I I think that they now know that he obviously does not have amnesia. He I believe that since they didn't kill him but then they believed that he had amnesia, they felt like he's dead. So to me it almost feels like it's not they're not after trying to <clears throat> eliminate the criminals but rather the criminal activity and so it just so happens that these other people they eliminated them but Lee Siggy the flower killer he made it look like he forgot about who he is or who, who he was and so may, maybe they felt like you know what since he doesn't know who he is anymore we'll, just let him we'll, we'll leave him plus uh, Killing him right now would be too big of a cl uh, clue for the, the other detectives, detectives you know, know, knowing who we are. Yeah. And they, of course, we find out that the who the, the identity of the godmother, or at least who we believe it's the godmother Mignon. is. And we believe that, yeah, it's Min Young um, because of the shoes. Also, they, they, they show a scene where she was actually standing next to Bo Hyung as he took the shot. To kill shy guy yeah and she's been getting a lot of it's like i just she was saying she's been getting a lot of hints lately and for her to be to the begin with was actually there's these imposter detective that actually we have song jiho who comes at the beginning who thinks it's kwang su and she beat the shit out of kwang su and it turns out that she's been she got scammed by some fake detectives and nobody knows about it but all of a sudden like min young knows about it and right. so it's like a it's like to purposely bring her team there or something like that so it's like it could be she's in on it you know she could be the godmother or she's not the godmother but she is with on this team 
you know, this other team who's doing all these things and she's a part of them, you know? Right. And, and I'm guessing she was supposed to go undercover to be under with these detectives, but obviously, you know, things slipped out, they didn't turn well, and she stayed a little bit longer with them. But yeah. Yeah, but whatever the case is, uh, the next episode is going to be the final episode of the season. Which is going to be uh, the Lee Siggy case, really. Yeah, it's right? for Lee Siggy it's, it's and... For, it's for the flower killer. And I think that... I Obviously, we don't know what the case they're going to work on. But the whole point is the flower killer is now next to be eliminated. Yeah. Because he's the final person on the list of the kill, of the, of the hit list for criminals on the flash drive. Yeah. And of course, remember guys, on the flash drive, there was a 2021 folder as well. That but they couldn't open. Yeah, they could not open. So, I don't know. I think we just kind of like flew by our head. I think all these episodes was giving us hint to be able to unlock it. I think it just flew by us. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, because but... that, that's how it was for, for every season so far. Yeah, every season, so... they, each episode had clues and hints. Yeah, but... Um, but I, I, don't, I don't know if they're actually even going to try to figure out the Jihu case. I think she was just... I think she was just She to, was just there to fill to, in to for fill like a cameo. To, yeah, to let them yeah. know that there is some imposter detectives out right. there who's been taking on cases, but taking their money and just running away with it. And then so that's what, that was her hint to get them to go out there yeah. and find it. But right. I think we've discovered now why is it that Minyoung's obviously the one who has all the money. Because she is a part of the imposter detective group. Mm-hmm. And so they, they, she basically the, basically the scale get, of balance. Yeah, that's what the ba- other team is. Yeah, basically they get money and then she gets money to have to use. And you know, she, she keeps all the other detectives in the loop. And then while the detectives <clears throat> solve and bring out the criminals, the scale, the, 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 the scale of balance group organization eliminates, eliminates them. So, yeah. but yeah. That's it for this episode. Stay tuned for our reaction. This was actually a very good episode. We had a yes. lot of laughing and a big fat reaction. Yeah. You guys will see. So stay tuned for that. And we'll see you guys next week for the last Final episode, episode for Busted Season 3. Yep. See you guys. See you guys. He's hella suspecting her. <laughs> the way he's looking at her. Take it, Anya. Oh no! Oh, oh. I almost—I thought he was pantsless. What is he wearing? Those are the same shoes. <laughs> oh! Oh! No! No, no, oh! no! No! no. <laughs> it's supposed to represent that Jisoo! That Jisoo! It's supposed to represent them! That Jisoo! Oh, they, they messed up, look. Scared. <laughs> 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 
오히려 이제 그만 해줘 다. 